Hey, chat, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. How's everybody doing today? This awesome Friday. Awesome now, because I'm here hanging with all of you. Editing speedrun. World record random seed glitched. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna hack a little bit. We're gonna do some cheating. It's gonna be fun. Uh, you guys get to see a little bit inside of the process uh, today, so it's gonna be definitely going to be interesting. First time here. Hey, Ariel. <laughs> First time here on time. Good hey. thing to know. Hey. It works now. It works now. Username, thank you for subscribing. Also, that's so two months for username, six months for TNT. I give it 20 minutes until Premiere crashes. 20 minutes. Any more than that and you use witchcraft magic. Dude, I had it for like hours on end and Premiere doesn't crash. I have no idea how you, that's that bad for you. Thank you for the 100 bits. But yeah, no, I've been editing for like an hour. <laughs> I've been editing for like an hour. Actually, no, I've been recording for like hours, but I've been editing like crazy to try to get this video done. And it's refusing to get done. So we're gonna try to do it uh, today. Yes, TNT, I know you, tr you tried to rush. I know we're gonna do that next week because we're gonna do a whole big thing. And I wanted to give people an actual week's notice for this. Hi, boy, hi. Thank you for following. Welcome to the stream. What's the video about? I'm going to show you all in just a minute. But, <clears throat> I know you finished. I know you finished, my friend. But here we go. Right? Everyone, next Friday is the final day for the current Lagundo SMP. You have one week from today to make your final builds, your final notific- your final things, make your final mark, try to hit those leaderboards. Uh, no, I want the lights! <laughs> I was gonna turn them off. I was gonna turn that off. Uh, one week from today, next Friday, we are going to do a stream. I'm gonna have a Google Doc, a Google Form. I, I saw the wheel. I have a Google Form which is gonna go out to the Discord. Yes, there has always been, but there will be a new one very, very soon. So a Google form is gonna go out to the Discord where you're gonna be able to give coordinates that you would like me to teleport to. Uh, and instead of just land spawns, it's gonna be like exact coordinates. So if you wanna set up that like big, perfect panoramic shot of your world, you're gonna give sets of coordinates. The mods will be on with me. They'll be checking ahead so that nobody does any shenanigans. So we'll have that, okay? But, uh, we're gonna have a Google Doc. It is not ready for today. It will be coming a little bit later. Uh, probably over the weekend at some point in time, if we can get this done. So, we'll see what happens. <laughs> no demonetizable shenanigans. Some regular shenanigans are perfectly okay. So, hopefully, we're gonna be able to get that to work. Uh, wow, a tie. Everybody is either between 1 and 5k or above 20,000 cookies. Um... Uh, we don't have any memes for your streams. Oh, there's quite a few. Um, there's quite a few. I don't, TNT, I'm sorry, but I need to get this video done today. I really do. If, if Friday doesn't work, we'll do it on Wednesday instead. I will find a day that works for the most people. But the SMP is ending next week at some point in time either Wednesday or Friday, one of the two streams. I'll figure out when the mods are available, when TNT, who's done something very special to send off the server as well, is also available. Uh, very soon, Lagundo SMP Season 1 ending. About two or three weeks after that, Lagundo SMP Season 2 is gonna be starting up. We have the new world ready to go. I'm super excited, it's gonna be great. I'm super, super hyped. It's gonna be good. The new world is quite interesting. I'm very happy for it. Um, uh, ours, our, our SMP, it's gonna be great. Have you watched, uh, I have not, I have not. The OG is like, oh wait, the new one or the old one? The old one, yes. Yeah, we're about a week away from all of the plugins and server infrastructure that we need 
being updated. We're finalizing our builds for the spawn, configuring our plugins, setting up some cool stuff. Let me just say it might be a really good idea to be a Twitch subscriber uh, on the server <laughs> as well. Uh, so it's going to be good. I'm super excited. I'm super hyped. A lot of people put a lot of work into it, so it's going to be good. Uh, great cartoon called... Oh, that's cool. Hey, Victor. How you doing? You're back. Hey, Camo. Welcome back. All right. So into the meat of today's stream. Whoa. Leg burn, leg eat. Uh, thank you very much uh, for subscribing. Larry! A two-month streak three months subscribed hype train is activated it's at 69 percent hype uh it's just the lagundo community smp um don't check it on stream but check some support tnt i have not had a waking moment to to get on the smp i really apologize i've been i've been trying to tell you i had not had a chance everything has been either working on this video or a lot of work i'm not ignoring you i didn't see your message sorry boss uh you know what message you're gonna type? Well then, there you go. There you go. Okay. We should probably get started. You're doing what your part. Thank you, Richard. Uh, we have a wheel that we have to kick off. And then we're gonna get into it. So, some of these obviously won't apply because we're not playing Minecraft for today. But if we hit one of those, we'll just respin. Sound good? Sound good to everybody? Cool. Yep, I got you. I got you, username. All right, may you be judged harshly. Good luck. You barely graduated high school. How does one barely graduate high school? Go mining. Okay, I can't do that because we're not playing Minecraft, so. <coughs> nope. You get nothing. You get nothing, username. So sorry. You are denied. We need... <laughs> every time. Every time. I would never do that to all of you. I... <laughs> big sad. Oh, so sorry, y'all. <coughs> Today was the last day of school. Awesome, Penguin. You could have gotten yeeted. That is true. All right, let's get into what we're doing. So I'm gonna put us in the Minecraft, into the Minecraft category because I think um, it actually makes sense. Uh, editing my next 100 days, days ish. You would have rather gotten timed out. At least something would have happened, right? So. Uh, yeah. Uh, 69% hype train. Nice. Yeah, no, nice. So this is where the magic happens. This is where all of that recording gets turned into a video. I did, Richard, but for projects like this, where it's super tight on time, there's no other alternative. And just like perfect storm, uh, George's internet was out until just recently. Uh, Horse is dealing with some stuff, and Sierra is soon gonna be back. He's on vacation, so it's a little bit of everything. So we're not exactly playing gold. We're editing. We do have to do an hour of 117, which I might do on stream. We'll see, depending on how everything plays out. How am I versus? Uh, computer audio as well. Do do. Uh, party with graduating class. All right, see you later. He's a total pro. That sounds great. I want to tell you that I love you. Uh, yes, TNT. Yes, I have. Larry, thank you for the gifted sub. Uh, Chrono, Chronocturn, congratulations on being needed into subscribership. Music's a little loud. How about that? Well, I mean, gee, I wonder with the big version number right here, and then it's saying 114 right after it. 
<laughs> hey, Persona. Person, how you doing? Option on 117 blocks. Opinion on 117 blocks update. I like it. Uh, what's the iron farm I want to make? It's based off the Doc M design. I just tweaked it a little to make it more aesthetically pleasing. So, yeah. It's just that. It's just a Doc M design. All right. Level one complete. Level two. Let's see if y'all can crush it. But I've spoiled this a couple times. I'm perfectly content um, spoiling it more on stream as well. Also, somebody set the timer. Uh, of course, says 20 minutes and it doesn't crash. And I have black magic. So, uh, oh, sorry, it was witchcraft. So, uh, my witchiness will be revealed. So, I'm not starting from zero. Right? I really hope you love me too. Wait, what? We're counting to pi? No, no, none of that. Uh,. Maybe later, we'll see, I don't know, because I need to get through a lot of this. So, we've gone, we start in 1.0. And yeah, I'm actually gonna record the voiceover for all of this too, okay? So, we're working our way through. We get our things, we bully some techno blades. we go get some coal, we get some tools, we run around, we get some more coal. We go to a very different looking swamp, and we full on Shrek it. And we live in a sh live in a swamp in this world. Go mining, hide in some dirt, fight some creepers, grab some gold. I have no skin because it's old stuff. Uh, doo -doo -doo. But we have the starts of our house, and then we start doing more. Boats are garbage in old Minecraft. It cracks against a lily pad. <laughs> it's absolutely bad. Uh, Bully some technos here, just a little bit. So I'm Shrek in this one. Every every video I try to do a build differently. In this one, I I built in a swamp. So I'm gonna make a couple different Shrek jokes. It took us 19 days to find diamonds, I think. Uh, but the house is coming along. Uh, let's see, where's a good shot of it somewhere? It's a nice little like, oh yeah, that's where we get to the end. I have no skin. Uh, we do get an elytra that we're flying around in 1.12. We do like some little mini mushrooms. I don't use the end rods because I didn't have as many. So I just use a little fence post. Lots of creeper fighting, running around. So basically, the gist of it is that the game updates every hour in this video. <coughs> oh no. So the game updates every hour. So it's about three or four days in each ver major version of Minecraft. So 113, then we get to here, and this is 114, and then this is this is 114 is where we're at. So yeah, day 47 goes into day 48, 1.14, and I have three or four editing things to do so ah, oh god it's already in the quotes uh well thank you very much hot dog much appreciated all right so we're just gonna start editing we're just gonna start editing and work our way through it it's not exactly a hundred days video but it's a we get as far as we can video in 17 hours worth of gameplay, which is about About 70 days worth if you really Are aggressive on sleeping So we'll see um, uh, I'm gonna start tracking That I'm editing in our in our editing in their system Yo, get that world record. I believe in you. Uh, and do, 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 calendar. So we... That works. Timer. Start my timer. So I'm ed actually editing now. Music is a bit loud still? Let's put it down a little bit more. 
No, I got you. I got you. Hey, horse. How you doing? Oh, horse is the current hype train conductor, apparently. <clears throat> so horse had kicked it off with the bits. Much appreciated. All right, so we fly. We fly. All right, Chief is here. Hey, Chief, how you doing, buddy? So this is gonna be interesting. I, I I usually just do this. I put a podcast on, and I and I just kind of go quiet and do my thing. So between watching chat and everything else, it's gonna be interesting. Like staying on track of things and being good to go. Uh, your internet is dying. Oh no! Chief's wife or password? Read your podcast now. Uh. Yeah, I mean, we were immortals in the SMP, so I wouldn't be surprised. Base flooded. Ooh, that's rough, Chief. Oh, no. Um, oh, no. How does the Navy... I think that's called sinking at that point. And hello again, hot dog. Yeah, I think that's called sinking at that point, in all honesty. So, okay. First thing we do. First thing we do for each segment is chop up our days. So that would be the end of, so that's day one. We get to about, do, 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 do. wow, we went long on this one. Okay. So, boop, so that's the day. We'll chop that up. Uh, oh yeah, we got a, a thing, some cursed sand. And we're just gonna do this one, one video at a time. And we're gonna try to get through all of them. And then I need to record all of the inter little interstitials, all of the audio, all of the 1.17 gameplay, the intro graphics, the outro. <sighs> it's gonna take some time. It's gonna take some time. All right, so let's, let's -a go. Uh, sound lights look make more chaotic than TTS. Wait, what? I mean, yeah, a little bit. Alright, so, what do we got here? That's me getting back in the house. Okay, so I jumped on the horse. So, okay. You two. Alright. Alright, see you later, TNT. Alright, so day. Boop, boop. Good establishing shot. Do the things, Welcome. avoid the stuff. Trader Killer, hello, thank you for following. Lights go out, lights go ka -chow. Oh no. Okay, over the river and through the deserts on a horse with no name. Uh, nope. Actually bullying techno. We need to get me in Minecraft championship and then maybe that can happen. Nah, I wouldn't actually Welcome. bully techno. That would be hilarious though. Hot dog, thank you for following as well. Welcome to the stream. You're both second place and fourth place? Oh yeah, because you switched accounts. <coughs> hey Smalls, no worries. It's all good. Nice little one second shot. And then Skyrim horsing it. So we'll do there. Show me going down the hill, which would be cool. A nun, a horse, and a fire captain walked into a bar. Ow. They all said in unison. Now, what are the chances of that happening in unison? Use N, H, and F to calculate the possibility assuming that there is 100 milliseconds in each second, and then assume that each M took exactly 0.87 of a second. What are the chances that they all said down at the same time? Uh, seven. At least six, at least seven. Usernames didn't sync. Oh no. All right, so I need to get, correct answer is math. Yep. Okay. Hi legs. Hey turtle, or hello not a turtle. Okay, so didn't get anything good out of that. So this this horse kept disappearing on me. So 
super weird. So I walk my way up into this village. I walk my way up into this village, and then I need to talk about how they don't have any beds. So they don't consider it a real village, so they're all wandering around everywhere. So, yep. Hey, Minecraft Pro here. A little bit. Ten minutes in? Oh yeah, we'll be fine. Uh, with the zombie hole in the middle of their town. Nope. That they seem entirely unfazed by. <coughs> So I, where did, so I, no, I tie the horse up, I try to, oh yeah, I get attacked by way too many zombies, because it still triggers a zombie raid. There we go, that's a good shot for it. A little bit of wood, because I was going to try to make a bed, but I didn't have any wool. This is 114, yes. So I... Abandon them. I actually want a shot of when I get the horse. There we go. So about there, cut to there. No! You monster! Why would you do that? <laughs> you just ate a cupcake? Nice. Crash within the next five? Nah. Okay. So I need to do 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 do. Okay. Crafted the bed. And slept the night. There we go. Uh, Neo from the Matrix or John Wick from John Wick? I mean, the Matrix is pretty depressing. And John Wick is immortal, so... There's no way that that doesn't happen, so I would pick John Wick. <laughs> yeah, no, 100%. I've totally been around only for a few days. Alright, so that's editing later. Uh the last three hours. Ah yeah, I know that feeling. <clears throat> In an alter I mean yeah. Oh yeah, and I found- Okay, so this is the first time the spookiness happened. Watch this. Watch this and try to explain to me why this happens. Right? So, we're walking through. I find some rails sitting on the ground. Okay? I get off the horse. Right here. And it vanishes. It's invisible. Full on spooky. Right? And it's just- Gone. Horse is just utterly gone. I spend five minutes of this day looking around for it. Cannot find it. Then watch this. This just happened last night, so I knew it happened. Like, where I'm sitting here. And then all of a sudden, it just pops back into the world. I, I, could, I can't see it. Hold on. Is it, was it there? Nope, it wasn't there. Right, watch this. It's not there. Hey Noah, how you doing? And then it just pops back into the world. It's not entity rendered distance because there are entities further out that you can currently see. And I don't know why it does, it does that. Uh, hey Grumpy Man, how you doing? They're giving you Shelby flashbacks. Uh, don't worry. Uh, only bad things happen, so it's fine. Uh, recovered the horse, get to inside this temple. Show off, let's show off all the loot. I'm doing pretty good, keeping busy, 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 busy. 
So show off chest number one. Chest number two. Chest number three. Nothing too good. Chest number four. Absolute trash. Uh, gonna go for a bit. All right, see you later. For sure, seeing as it can teleport. Uh, about a different sort. Nice. All right, so that's there. Collected all the stuff. Back up and out. Back on the horse. Ow. Good establishing shot. Over the hill. Found a second desert temple. Found a second desert temple. And then... <coughs> uh, the whole John Wick series. I mean, it's a good movie series. Okay, so that's the shulker I was dumping everything into. There we go. So, chest number one. Ah, uh, Gundulok has some moments in this world. Chest number two. Chest number three. We got quite a few golden apples in the world without having to craft any so far. Chest number four. Garbage. <laughs> uh... Um, nah, that's okay. I wouldn't talk about yourself like that, Camo, to be honest. Like, flatly. Alright, um, okay, yeah, let's do this. I removed some cursed sand, accidentally burying myself alive for a few seconds, but don't worry, it's totally fine. Uh, before repairing my elytra... Oop, nope, boop, boop. Okay, so that's that. So 14.2, nope, stop that. That's what I want to know. Horse, do you know any key where these things highlight randomly and I need to turn them off? I don't know why they do that, being totally honest. Um. Wait, what? Just respect. No, this is hardcore. This is 100% hardcore. Uh, wait. Part three. Did I miss part two? I think I missed part two. Or did I name part two? Oh, I forgot to import part two. Whoops. Found that out. Okay, that needs a second to normalize. All that for it. Yep. Nope. Uh. No, it is hardcore. It's 100% a hardcore. I'm confused. Yeah, no, it's hardcore. It's just the hearts are kind of small. Um, this is another video that I recorded before I realized my UI is a little small for uh, YouTube. Also, this video is super small. You're gonna see it in, you're gonna be able to watch it in 4K so it'll be normally sized. Whereas this is like less than a 720p size window. So it's kind of hard to, so day 50. Still on 114. Uh, see dog, me the hungry, see cuddle dog. Uh, I would, Claire, but dog's not anywhere around here and I can't yell. Sorry. <laughs> hey, awesome. How you doing? A uh, couple hundred a year. It's a subscription service, actually, at this point now, which I don't 100% agree with, but it's the easiest way to get to it. There we go. Get some of that for paper. <coughs> yup. 
They treat it as a subscription service now. Which I don't like, but... Oop. Yep, that's the ravine I almost fell into. Uh, we went back to where the horse spooked away. And then I just rode around randomly. Until it disappeared again. <laughs> So we'll just take this bit. We'll put it to 50 times speed. Uh, popcorn, 100%. And then, hold on. So we go here. I... So we're here. Boop, boop. So I get onto it again, I get in the river, I get the lead to get it, and it vanishes. Entirely gone. The horse just up and yeets themselves out of there. And I stand there for a good... It just, it just vanishes. I have no idea what happens. I'm like... Standing there, stunned in silence, hands off the keyboard and everything. I have no idea what to do. It's just vanished. And then... Luckily, I have my Elytra, so I can just fly around anyway. And I'm like a hundred blocks away from a brand new village. Okay, so then there's that. Get in, start looting the village for everything. Yep. Nope. Brand new village, which I went in to say hello to. And then immediately started... Which I immediately started looting for all of its resources. Nope. A horse was made into a taco. That checks. That works. Uh... Took after my best buddy Skies and did a little bit of capitalism with all of the villagers. There we go. Uh, what's the video? It's uh, a 100 days type video, but it updated every hour. Yes. So, okay. So here's the whole process, right? I have notes. I have notes, a Google Doc with notes, where I have basically my, this is what I'm going to actually, hold on, I should put this over here um, I have a Google Doc with notes of like every tick that I'm gonna talk about in all of the videos and like I'm up to doop I'm up to here so I've edited this much right simple bold well it's inside a folder that's specific to this uh, to this video right bees yeah <laughs> yeah see see look at that Look at that amazing update note right there. Look at that amazing update note right there. Hold on, let's make it a little bit bigger. Bees! Because version 115 really, the only notable feature that was added in 115 was bees. So, yay. So we'll put that back there for right now. Um, so yes, I normally, as I'm playing, I write down my notes for what happens. I then cut the video knowing what the notes basically are. Shh, you'll see. Uh, I cut down the video knowing what the notes roughly are. And then from there, I do the commentary and then I match the commentary to the video a little bit. Stop luring. <laughs> uh, that sucks. I might be doing something soon, Hot Dog, that can help you with that. We'll see. We'll see. That could be cool. <laughs> so, keep an eye out. I got, I got some things in the works that could be fun. Alright. Do do. Wait, okay, so what's the shot before this? Do some capitalism with the, th with the peoples. Crafted up a couple. We just need just that sentence worth of video footage. 
crafted up a couple lecterns and started teaching the magic. Nope. Yeah. And started teaching the villagers magic, hoping that they would be able to get. <laughs> oh, why? Why? Okay, so that works. You clear in and out. 14 part two. Uh, some bees, uh, some bees, uh, yep. No, 100%. We need, we need a bee emote, maybe. Wait. 14 part three. No, stop it. See, why does that happen? When does that keep getting activated? Okay, part three. Yay. Okay, so. Stealing, I actually don't need any of this. That's the sleeping into the into this day. All right. Yeah, no, they, they like lore. Uh, they like the lore. They have all sorts of stuff. Hey, Nord, how you doing? So that's, that's 50, so this is day 51. Ow, my neck. <coughs> okay, so I did this for quite some time. Oh yeah, so this person got stuck. This one got stuck on Aquafinity. So I instead went out to another one, and then they also got stuck. I think there's a bug in older versions. Oop, so play, teach me magic. Multi-shot, which is close, but totally not, which is close, except for all the letters needed to be different and in a different order. So then, chase, 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 follow, 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 magic, 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 magic. I was at this for way too long. Magic, 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 magic. And then, yay, there it is. So we'll do speed duration. 25 times, so that is fast, but not super fast. Uh, do we remember? Uh, so it's 100 days, it's not exactly 100 days, it's hardcore, but it updates every hour. So it's gonna be probably about 70 days worth of stuff. I'm debating, I'm gonna call it 100-ish days. Uh, because, yeah. All right, so then this needs to be bigger. Mending. Couldn't afford it. <laughs> Which started me trading. I saw the collections. This all the stuff. Hey! 5K to unplug. Oh no. <laughs> Gonza, thank you for subscribing. Uh, welcome to the Be Good Gang. Four months. Four months with the Prime sub. Very nice. Alright, so... Cause me to... But... And then Smalls! Uh, with another Tier 1 sub. Two months! Resubscribed. Thank you so much, my friends. And then it's just nothing but wheat for closer to three minutes. Speed and duration. Nope. Cancel, cancel, cancel. Uh, speed, duration. 2500. Speed that up a little bit. <clears throat> Fried chicken is amazing. Traded all of that in, and I still didn't have it. So I had to go to the composter. Oh, 
uh, five hardcore worlds that you died on day 15. Day 15's a curse for you then. I would 100% just lock yourself in your house in your next one for day 15. Don't do anything. I would 100% not do anything. Okay. That went through tonight. I was knock I was knocking them out of their beds to do more capitalism. Before we're sleeping the night. Then this is day 52. And this is part three, right? Yep, this is part three. So that's it. We're done with 114 right after this. Time does the KFC sauce go hard? I'm still a Popeye's main, right? Popeye's spicy chicken sandwich is S tier, in my opinion, right? It's gonna do the alert again? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. I think you need to reshare a message, but either way, it's totally fine if you do the alerts. I like hearing those sounds. They make me happy. I full on dopamine trained myself. I like them. Okay, so. Doo -doo -doo -doo. What version did it start in? 1. Uh, 1.0. Hey! There you go. Somehow you got that message to display twice. That's cool. So yeah, so 17 hours worth of gameplay. I, ha I just haven't recorded one this the 117 stuff yet. Because it's going to be a big finale. And I just haven't done it yet. It Uh, yeah. So we, no, so not a lore command, but a, a, I, I'm gonna have a lore emote soon-ish. I just need to get things done. Okay, so that's, nope, that trading didn't work. So I got all my emeralds together. And they were gone. They full on pulled, they had full on traveled to the horse dimension and were known no longer anywhere to be found. And I'm gonna get that pun in there somehow. Do, 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 do. So that works. Yes, it has silk touch. So that was the easiest way for me to do it. Uh, and I had to restart the entire process over again with the new villager. Which wanted to give me Halo Infinite, but it's a little too early for access on that. Um, and then I basically, I put down more book more lecterns until the entire village was stuck in librarian mode. And nobody, nobody knew any better. So I abandoned the village at one point. Yep, so I abandoned the village. Uh, everything, we're editing a video, TTT. Flying over train that finally looks like Minecraft, I remember. Landing in this. Uh, would you end the hardcore series? No, I would do both. I have full control to do both. Uh, but yeah, when Halo Infinite comes out, we're totally gonna play Halo Infinite as well, but we're totally gonna stream on the Minecraft Hardcore world. Like, I want to do both. I love both games. Soak Touch. Uh, yep. Okay, found another, another village, and then once again got all of them stuck into education. <laughs> I got all of them to spec hard into education without giving me the magic that I wanted. There's a lot of this. The beast go buzz buzz boots fat eyes boots. Thank you for the hundred bits. So that worked to there. 
everybody was stuck as a librarian at this point again. So, I thought maybe it was a Minecraft glitch, so I just waited until the 1.15 update. Uh, do, 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 do. So instead I just stole all of their melons. Ha 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 ha, I'm a monster. And then that is the update. So boop boop, take that over. Move that up. So four days and one fourteen. Not bad. Uh, grab this. Negative. How do you have negative one hundred cookies, Jay? That's impressive. If you've somehow pulled that off. All right. So pull this again. What is it that makes this activate? I really don't know, and it annoys me, because then every time I try to drag it in, it only wants to put stuff on one track. <coughs> so. Yeah, so everybody was stuck. So, uh, hold on. Next day. Everybody's still stuck on their bad magic. So I just stole all of their weeds instead. I am a monster. Uh, I'm doing good. Better now than I'm hanging out with all of you all. Alright. So then eventually, I cornered two of them in a hole to teach them dark magic. <laughs> Wait for it. There we go. So from here, this is the shot. Uh, yep. So I cornered two of them in a hole to teach them dark magic. And eventually, and I mean eventually, because it took a hot minute. Yellow, okay. How about that? Speed duration. Do, 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 do. Uh, wait. I don't every time classes out. At least you shout us, don't do drugs. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, but yeah. Oh, don't be like that. <laughs> no alert command. Feel free to chill. It's all good. You don't need to call out that you're you're just hanging out. It's all good. Caffeine is a central nervous system stimulant of the methylxanthine class. It is the world's most widely consumed psychoactive drug. Unlike many other psychoactive substances, it is legal and unregulated in nearly all parts of the world. Yup. Okay, so 53, 115. This is Premiere Pro, Adobe Premiere Pro. Cocaine bad drug. <laughs> yep. All right, so I needed to quickly fly around so yeah so I I found some leather behind one of the houses just sitting there <laughs> so I found some leather behind one of the houses just sitting there about there uh, you're a monster you mind birch wood with a pickaxe ah! no. <laughs> dad 2.0 yep and quickly Quickly flew to a nearby lake to get a little bit of sugar. Trading for my mending book. There we go. So to there. Boop. Boop. Perfect. I think I immediately fixed up the... Yep, and then immediately got it enchanted. Nope. Uh, dark oak, dark oak, or I have to say spruce or jungle right now. It's definitely my one thing. Dead 1.0 for for kid you know. Yep. 
Uh, the world has thought of you after all of them. I appreciate you. I appreciate you, Smalls. And then secured. Hold on. Nah, it's all good. And then secure. Hold on. Let's do that. I need some logs. I need a bed. And then and then secured. Then secured my favorite villager friend in a really safe place. Do do do. There. And I gave him a nightlight. I gave them a nightlight over there. Where they would be safe forever. <laughs> I'm so bad. Alright, see you later, person. Thank you for tuning in. Alright. Finally flew my way back to the house. Other thing. No! That's the worst corgi. Yeah, I had something really crazy happen in this world, too. Here we go. A little bit of gunpowder. Occasionally landing to kill mobs to experience to refresh my elytra. And then sword all the way. All the way. Back. Back. Look at that clean landing. So to here, people love hopper dragons. No. Okay, so this yeah, this cuts in the next day, right? I think I go here and I go to sleep. Perfect. Fifty-four. <laughs> brute brute pigs are super scary. Okay, took stock of all my. Okay, so. I took stock of all the enchantments that I had currently reserved, as well as... Throwing Sharpness 5 that I got from one of the desert temples onto my sword. Then it's down to the basement. Okay, no, sorry. It's using... Started placing a lot of the new blocks around my house. I need multiple shots of that. Put a composter for decoration because why not? Like a little urn. That's like the montage segment while doing a bunch of things. Hey, Carp. Do, 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 do. There we go. And then offloaded. There we go. And then offload a bunch of the resources that I collected over the last little bit into all of my storage chambers. There we go. Me and Navy. That's cool. Yeah. It'd be nice to travel again. One day. One day. I spent a lot of time organizing my stuff. Oh, wow. More than I expected. It's almost 10 minutes of just organizing stuff. Yeah, I saw some boys roll up. 
into my swamp, which I just didn't have any of that. Okay, so... Going to Tennessee on Monday. Nice. Uh, what is this video? Also, did you get a haircut? What am I doing? Editing. What is this video? Uh, Minecraft hardcore, but every hour it updates. Did I get a haircut? Yes! <laughs> yes, yes, and yes to all of the above. Uh, day 55. Welcome. I start... Uh, Ice Boy, thank you for following. Day 55. I started flying. I forgot to start recording until I was almost at the village. Um, and then this is the raid. You throw at everything you do, nice. Uh, I do! It is ending next week, and a new season is starting, Hot Dog, so. If you want to very quickly make your impact on the existing world, go ham for about six days. Uh, but then we will be starting V2 of the SMP shortly after, uh, shortly after the world has kind of reset, reset. So, yes, yes, yes. I'm excited. You'll join in a week. So it's going down in a week, and it's going to be out for about a week or two as we finish configuring all of the plugins. But yeah, server history. The server will have a download file. Uh, there will be a download of the world map. We're making that available. Just finalizing a couple details of that, and then we should be good to go. Yes, it will reset. There will be a new season. Uh, it's going to have some different plugins. It's going to operate a little differently. Uh, so it's going to be interesting. We have some different things that we're adding to it, some different things we're experimenting with. Um, it will not be just a reset. It's actually like revamping a lot of things about the server as well. Uh, it will be 117. It will not have the 118 preview on it just because it's that's incomplete. So it's best to not have the resource pack on it. So it will be 117 train generation. <coughs> and then obviously it'll update to 118 when it's ready. So I'm super excited. Uh, ending the hardcore world after 118. Why? Why would I? I'm not ending the hardcore world ever. I'm keeping it until I die. As long as I can. Okay. And then landed with the raid bar. Progressing upwards. This this village was cool. I didn't mean to land at this village. I was trying to land back at the at the village that I had been at before. So actually, I can make this a little bit bigger. To, actually, I can totally just make this a little bit bigger while I'm doing the cutting, so you all can see it a little bit better, right? I didn't mean to land at this village. I meant to go back to the village I got mending in. But the cool thing about this village is that it had a drowned, uh, drowned temple above ground, and there was a bunch of drowned down in there. And you can see right there. Let's see if we can zoom in a little bit here. You can see a trident, a trident friend right there which was very interesting to deal with. It w if it was a glitch, it was a really cool one because there's more structures underneath it. I think what happens is it's an order of operations for where all of the structures say they're gonna generate and then which one generates where because there's basically like a little divot in the ground where the village spawned above the structure. And then I'm guessing the structure also thought it needed to spawn, so it spawned on the top most on top of the top most existing block so it meant that those three and the one on my left were not underwater which was a really cool little detail that i really liked so just something small so and survey the land with the yeah survey the land with some drowned structures under over the water which was interesting 
Uh, yeah, and that one trident one kept throwing tridents at me. I leveraged the fact that I had infinity arrows and cheesed the raid from on top of this tree, basically. So I want there to be my first shot. Nope. Uh, hello, Gundo. Uh, hey, Banana. How you doing? Dude, no. Bonk. Missed. Bonk. Hey, horse. So, yeah. So, the raid just... It's weird. This raid is weird. Arrow done. There we go. Two. Perfect. Raid one, raid level one complete, and then I, I do, while the raid is recharging, I come over here to see what's going on. And then I, I get attacked by the trident one. There's actually two of them right there, so that was a lot to deal with. Oh lordy coming. Uh, so yeah, I think you deserve way more. I mean, spread the word, my friends. That is, that is the biggest way to, to let people know, is to share the videos with your friends, post them on social media, that's, that's the biggest way. We'll get there, we'll get there. We build it, people come, it comes in time. So, okay, so, shot, hit, shot, miss, shot, hit, shot, miss, shot, miss, shot, miss. I am a bad shot sometimes. Okay, so shot, miss, shot. And that's where I start to freak out about the Ravager destroying all of the leaves that I'm standing on, so I jump to the house instead. I do my best to save a few of the villagers. Boop. Yep, so I took a hit right there. Good evening. Good evening. In less than an hour, aircrafts from here will join others from around the world and you will be launching the largest <laughs> aerial battle in the history of hashtag ping pong. Hashtag ping pong. That word should have new meaning for all of us today. We can't be consumed by our petty differences anymore. We will be united in our common interests. Oh, I like this. This Perhaps has been changed. Perhaps it's that today is the 11th of June and you will once again be fighting for our freedom not from tyranny, oppression, or persecution but from annihilation we're fighting for our right to live to exist and should we win today the 11th of june will no longer be known as in legs streaming Pink holiday gang. but is the it doesn't know the how to say one voice we will not go quietly it doesn't know night. hard a's we will not vanish without a fight we're going to live on we're going to survive today we celebrate our hashtag ping kong day yeah it doesn't know it doesn't know soft it, it doesn't know uh soft a's so everything is a hard a so wait, did it start to get dark? No, that's not when I slept. What he said. <laughs> Thank you, Larry. Thank you, Chief, for the 200. Thank you, Larry, for the 100 bits. Much appreciated, my friends. There we go. So just blasting through all of them. Do, 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 do. So... That's the last raider on that one. Uh, dice, 1 to 10 is red and 11 to 20 is blue. Um, we can maybe do that. SJB, my friend, that is not how you grow your channel and that's not cool. Okay, take a break. See you in 10. All right. So, I understand, but you wouldn't appreciate it if I went and did that on your stuff, my friends. That's not okay. It's not okay. That's not how you grow. All right. Wave three. This is when the magic, magic-y ones start attacking. Uh, as the bits went on the screen. No, Chief, you missed it. Somebody clip it. Uh, no, Derpy, you got it too. But you both got it. Thank you both. Uh, like the old one. It's really just the same. The old one is just, just 
three months worth of growth. I just gave up and just buzzed it right over. One of these days I might actually like get try to do something that my hair actually is a little bit more filled out, but for right now I'll just I'll just go with it. I rock it. Okay, so where it started to get interesting. The, yep, here we go. This is who I want to kill. Quickly. That, that one zooms around so fast. Pull a rock, just go bald? I might. I don't think I could pull it off as well. Uh, I quickly slept to reset the day. Day 56. <clears throat> oh, you guys got it like three times. <laughs> oh, I see what you're doing. It's fine. Okay. Do, do. Where's the magic one? Okay, I don't have the kill on the magic one. I need to go back and find that. So I can't not show the kill. Nope, I think it's I think it's over here. I can't not show the kill on the on the magic key one. Oh, there it is. Got him. Okay, so there. That to there, to there. And there we go. Uh, YouTube recommended loving this. Well, thank you very much, Chibis. I appreciate it greatly. I so slept. I was just cheesing this entire raid by shooting down from a tree. Six or five, almost never. Person, if I could stream as my job, I totally would. If I could stream as my job, I'd be live in the middle of the day. But I have a day job, and I have two kids, and my time with them is super, super important. So, eight o'clock is about the earliest I could stream. I wish. I wish. But yeah. I wish. Yeah. It is hardcore. I'm not gonna do a day's video without doing hardcore. All right, all right, meme aside. I think it's good. Let the let one punishment go through. I appreciate you though. For jumping down to grab the first totem of undying in my world. Just block myself back up. Next. Yeah, so I want to see this. I want to see why it ends. Okay, so magic -y one here scares me. Pulls a jump scare with the Vex. Inventions, not sins. That would be interesting. Okay, so I missed a couple shots right here. magic you want to start calling out. Okay, cheese on the tree. Where's the Vex come in? Yep, here comes the Vex. I hate the Vex. Wait, did I update the date? Yes, I did. Cool. What do you put on mac and cheese? Salt, pepper, and bacon bits. If I if I can get it. But I have like a salt that also has like crushed red pepper in it, both in the same shaker, and it's so good. So 
So yeah, here's what happens. So Okay, last bit of the raid. Alright. Long range long shots down range. Okay. Killing the first wizard. Jump scared by Vex. So I go. Oh! That's what happened. That's what happened. So there it is. That's why it just ended. It didn't end. I there was I lost. They killed all the villagers. So I jump in. The raid goes to defeat right there. But I still have to deal with the So yeah, the village dent the village died. Here we go. Killing everything. Cleared them out. Collect all of the loot. Including my third totem. I I I'm I'm choosing to ignore what's happening. Ketchup on mac and cheese is a little a little different. <laughs> I'd rather eat. Don't let me catch you on that. Oh no. Oh. Ugh. Black pepper, black pepper, or I have this salt shaker that, like I said, it also has like red pepper flakes in it, so you grind it and it's both. It's not the main hardcore world, it's its own independent thread. There's an alternate timeline. That's ins okay, so it wasn't, it just ended. It wasn't ended. Uh. I just changed that to, I failed and everyone is dead. This is an alternate timeline. This is Ver Lagundo variant number L11723-43B. All right. Uh, anybody else watching Loki? Because heck yeah. Good stuff. Hi puppy. I raided the above ground sunken temple ruins and found pretty much nothing. Loki Loki's been I, I, I quite enjoyed the first episode. And then try to get that trident. Do you have a pet? I do, I have a puppy. He's he's hanging out right there. I say puppy, he's a bit of an old man, but he's I'm just hanging out right there. But no battle for me. There we go. Uh I don't know, maybe. I am burdened with glorious purpose like burn. <laughs> yup. That's, I slept in the deserted village. So, to there. Yeah. This is the only friend to read that. Give me good vibes. I try to. Uh, I'm not Papa Dragons. He's not here. He's gone. Day 57. 
So I was doing this. I did accidentally, in doing this, have the have the Papa Dragon skin on for about half of it, and I didn't even notice. You all heard that super quick. I'm impressed. Found another village right over the hill, which we will be doing something with later. How you doing? Yeah, that was another chest that leads to the same place. That was weird. I just gonna skip that. This song is so good. Yup, this is this is Chat's favorite song. To be honest. Or most of Chat's favorite songs. Flying around. And then where's the bees? And they found some. And I found some bees. How you look forward to it. It grows on you. Wait, wait Sierra's gone already? Alright, see you later, Sierra. Have fun on vacation. See you soon. Once you're back, we gotta get started on the thing. Yep. And all of the mossy cobble. There we go. And all of the other blocks that they're not really using. And then it was flew over. And then I decided to do this trick. And then interesting things happened. Watch this. Cobble plus vines, yes, or cobble plus moss. Now, uh, but in 115 you weren't able to craft it, or in older versions you weren't able to craft it. So I, I got it from every, I got it from every location I could. Yep. So did that. We started digging down. This, this is this is an interesting one. I was wondering uh, you, why you are. Yeah, and we had a, an interesting situation when I dropped into a, a thing. Oh, as a bit of a surprise. <laughs> Whoops! You never want to see that when you're in a hardcore world. <laughs> you never want to see that when you're in a hardcore world. And uh, yet, I saw that in a hardcore world. So that was whoops. Uh, I'm very lucky I did the raid. So I got the torches down. So I quickly torched up 
gave and grabs another extra life. There we go. Use toggle sprint? Uh, yes. Just for control's sake, I like being able to control it. We're digging back down. And then I think I got eight diamonds here. We're digging back down. Yep, I got eight diamonds out of that. Merged, it was nice. So I flew over to where the beehive was. Flew over to where the beehive was. Grabbed it. Flew to a nearby village. Bought off a couple children. Where, where are you? So, there. Basically, eat the child. Yep, 100%. Staying on brand and then sleeping here. All right, hold on a second. Sleeping here. Okay. Not bad. For this bit of the editing. Bees! Wait, this is 115 part two, right? Yeah, 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 okay. 116, see, it's, it's done this again and I don't know why. It's worse patching. I don't know why it does that. I really need to figure out why that does it and turn it off. Okay, 116 is there, but we're gonna take a brief break. We've been going for about 90 minutes. I'm gonna do a quick little three minute break, refill my water, take a quick stop. Uh, I enjoy you, all. I in invite you all to enjoy the memes and hang out a little bit because you need to make the paint and the gap bigger. Hashtag pink gang. I want to see it. All right. I'll be back in about, uh, about five minutes. All right. So enjoy the memes. Enjoy the, enjoy the ads if you're not a sub and catch you all in just a second. BRB.
Chief is now a VIP. Congratulations. <laughs> Not bad at all, friends. Pretty nice. Very nice. Congratulations on being the next, the most recent one to get that purple diamond. Love to see it. All right. We got no time to waste. No time to waste. Back to editing. Uh, yeah, try to be hot dog. Try to be. Yep, and see, you can see me in my, um, where is it? Where is it? Where's the pop dragon skin? Open up, open up my inventory. Yep, see, I forgot to change out of the Papa Dragon skin <laughs> from the other day. Um, would you make? Uh, yes, Neo. In fact, I did a year ago. Uh, we have a public M uh, public server. It's exclamation mark MC to get it. Uh, it's going down in a week though because it's upgrading to 117 and getting a full reset. So we'll be doing that somewhat soon. A uh, wheel spin, anti-social gamer calling that so again if we hit anything that is not quite uh, conducive to editing stream we will we will do that all right ready one two three go may you be judged harshly oh no very nice I need you to say something in chat so I can eat you into subscribership The wheel is kind today. Not rigged. <laughs> I love that that's the thing. Uh, that's the thing that everybody's like, not rigged. Gift sub, gift sub. Complete purchase. And, boom. Or not. There we go. The timing was a little off. Lagundo gifted a tier one sub to anti-social gamma live. There you go. The wheel has bestowed upon you a gifted sub. Congratulations, my friends. Very, very nice. Ooh, um, hot dog. If you want to see how I got my name, is one of the questions I actually answered back in my 100k AMA, right in January. Uh, so you can go check it out. I, I gave like the full answer to that. How, do, how can you get to spin the wheel? Uh, so save your cookies. You get them from being here, talking in chat, following the channel, obviously. If you cheer the channel, you get a bonus for the first cheer of the month. Subscribing uh, gets you a bonus as well. And joining us on raids that we can that we go and try to raid other channels and help boost them up as well. Uh, all of those are ways to get cookies. So just being a part of the community is a great way to do it. Uh, found the crystal thing. Nice! Didn't finish mining all the calcite. Yup, I am so happy to have all that calcite. I am so happy to have all that calcite. But yeah. You crashed your server? Yup. Okay, so, let's... I... Organize everything into the chest. It reminds me of Dolomite from Create Mod. So I'm so happy to have, like, a... a a white block that is like more pure white that's something in between quartz and white concrete so it's not like neon white but yeah so i'm gonna fly up and this is when i first got into my fabric so fly and then i saw that uh i have it bound to i have the cut video footage bound to uh, this button on my mouse, the like extra one of the extra buttons, so it makes my life easy. Uh, calcite is the white blocks outside of the amethyst. Yes. Yeah, it makes it makes life so much easier to have things like that. And then I have a couple other short keys on the macro buttons, on like my mouse, and on my keyboard. And my hand is literally in WASD position because I'm a true gamer. Uh, but yeah. And gross diorite. Diorite's pretty fine. You just need to build it in the right kind of build. Uh, yes, this is all on PC. Chest number two. Nope. Uh, nope. 
you cannot get calcite anywhere else. It is exclusively around amethyst geodes. Wait. That doesn't make any sense. The clip, like, reset. That's weird. By the way, I've been editing for an hour and a half and we haven't had a crash. Get wrecked, horse. Yep, you're gonna need a lot of that for your base. We might make a way on the SMP to get some more of it, so it's not super rare. Uh, because like maybe maybe it'll be sold at a at a decently high price. So we'll see. Here we go. There you go. Okay, fine. So that ends up to there. Mind a little bit of quartz. Just because. Did I get the day? Day 57, 1.15. No, I did not. Uh, day 58, 1.16. Uh, can you show the hardcore world and show us the nether monument? Maybe TCT. I'm trying to get this video done for tomorrow, right? And I still have an hour of 117 to play. So I might or might not be able to do it. I'm really trying to power through, but we're going to do a whole stream working on the nether monument. Uh, probably on Monday is going to be the next like back at it normal stream. Or if I get this video done, <coughs> maybe if I can release it over the weekend, maybe we can do a stream immediately after. Yeah, no, no worries, TTT, it's totally fine. I just kind of feel bad. Uh, of the Deep Slate, you mean? I think, wasn't Grimstone, Grimstone the old name? Yeah. Yeah, I have a, a nice double chest of it and the cobbled version and everything else. I'm so excited to use that in a future build. So that's... Grab all of those. Did we go back? Nope. I dipped it all. That's not a quote, Gordon. <laughs> uh. Yink. And around there. Let's get to there. And then up into. Yep up into my broken, busted nether fortress. Now, it's funny, I'm just like, that's not a quote. <laughs> and then over to my portals. My first nether portal was inside a nether fortress in this world. Do no luck, 100%. So, to there. To there. Oop. Okay, so that was this, 116, so we dropped off. I offloaded all of the valuables, so right there. So, offloaded all of the valuables into a valuables chest. Inventory management! The sexiest part of every uh, video. I grabbed a box. I filled a box with gold, TNT, and totems of undying. Planted down the bees' nests. Boop, boop. I did that on the bees nest. There we go. Dropped all the banners. I should I should show them the video. There we 
go. And then that goes underground. And then what happened next? I oh, started brewing. Yep, started brewing some potions. You're already starting with the lore. The lore, it's too much. Viva la lore! Yeah, no, I, I see that. Do, do, do. Made myself a golden helmet. Slept. Next day. Nope. Okay, so this is day 59. Yeah, this is gonna get, I think, to almost exactly 70 days. 65. Game Chance with a golden helmet. Some basic enchants. And plants some flowers over the crops so that the bees would pollinate everything as they were buzzing around. to here. Okay, so flew to here. Except so more message. Oh no, 100 percent That one hated me for a little while for some reason. I don't remember why. This time I didn't, to be fair, this time I didn't end up dropping them into a one by one block of lava, so I'm improving. Going to, going to sleep. DJPD upset? Nah, I'm fine. Who cares? Alright. Come on, get in your hole. There we go. Made three very happy piggy, boy, piggy boys. Uh, fought off a ghast. Nice shot. They almost got exploded. So if you open a shulker next to them, they all get mad at you. So I just went underground to collect all of the stuff. So yeah, so there. <coughs> Some decent, decent trades. Yeah, I kind of just left them there. No, no worries. We're finding a spot. Digging down to you. And I need a, uh, yep, my one by one tunnel. All of this. Do, 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 do. And then. Nice. So 
that goes to there. To there. What percent are we at? We're almost through everything I've currently recorded. And then I need to do all my voiceover and all the intro and outro bits, which are actually the most time consuming. Because those actually have like animations to them. What might happen is this video might come out on Sunday. I might end up finishing it tomorrow instead. We'll see. Nope. Uh, less than half. See, the voiceover, recording the voiceover bits is not hard. It's just the matter of getting things all lined up. So I did end up with four. Where's that fourth one that I got? Days, uh, one month, 21 days, 23 hours. Not bad, TTT. Uh, continue to, I'll just do like, continue to blast mine. Do, do, do. Ended with. with four inch debris, which is not bad. Just enough for one piece of armor. Do 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 to there. Quick day check, 59. Okay, we're good. Uh, music's a bit louder than you. Uh, yep, I absolutely forgot to turn it down after the streets. I keep forgetting to do that, thank you. Uh, no, thanks, T thanks TNT. Uh, what recording software? So I use Adobe Shadow Play, or sorry, Nvidia Shadow Play to do the actual recording. But yeah, Taco has had a night. Did you mess him up? Yay, Tango, yeah, Tango's music. I didn't even realize. Okay, so there. Through there. Land. See, and now I get the advancement, which is so weird. Five months. Yeah, it's been a little while. Uh, been watching you since your first hundred days. Well, hey, trader, how you doing? Things happen. Okay. Totally understand, dude. Stay safe and all that. Be careful. Alright, so move. That. Uh, watching you edit multitasking at his finest. Nice. Hey, chef. Taco good? Taco good is good news. Yeah. Here we go. More inventory management. Here we go. We're just gonna... We'll, we'll time lapse this bit. Because why not? the end of this truncated because I think this ends with this um, built into Minecraft where you open the pause menu yes so I do use that it's replay mod <coughs> I record specifically with shadow play so that way it's already in a video file format with replay mod you need to let it play out again which would take time uh, That would take quite a bit more time. So that's enchanting up. Okay, speed duration 2500. 
By the way, horse, I have not seen one crash for the entirety of the editing stream so far, about two hours. Sorry, buddy. Uh, wait, what? Wait, hold on. I didn't see that. You broke up. You broke both your legs while skydiving. Oh, jeez. That's rough. Grab this. Do 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 do. Yep, no, a hundred percent, Jeff. Hundred percent. Grab that. And in improve the helmets. There we go. There we go. Full on super villain. Walked in, walked downstairs. That's when I had to end. So wait, somewhere in that did the day pass over? Or did I miss it? Don't be like that. We all have our setbacks. No, that's actually a pretty full day. Okay. So wait, when we came out, was it... Oh no, that was first thing in the morning. So yeah. So yeah, that's first thing in the morning. So that's actually day 60 right there. Oh, if we end up on 69 days, I'm going to be so happy. Actually, part two. Yeah, it's weird. Automod can get touchy. Alright, so. Here's the most... Bullshit thing that happened to me in the entire playthrough, right? Check this out. Converted the diamond ore into diamonds. There you go. And then I go up. And same for the coal. Uh, the coal's not video worthy. Organizing a little bit of things. Then. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. We walk upstairs, and then there's a creeper in my house. And it blows up my house. <laughs> and I'm very upset. Ah. Oh. Right? So. I start rebuilding. <laughs> Creeper, oh man. I'm just upset throughout the whole thing. But I did notice that this back wall was wrong, so I did have a few seconds to fix that. That's good. Dude. Had to replace everything on these. I need to get more spruce. Uh, six hundred. How wide should each be? No more than five. Did you die in any of the hundred days? No. Uh, nope. Not at all. Then I wouldn't, I wouldn't put out a hundred days video, because I would have been dead. This takes, wait, uh, have you had any bad injuries? Not really, unfortunately, like, fortunately. I've been pretty lucky. I have like a recurring thing with one of my knees that's been kind of messed up, but yeah. That's just like an old, old, old injury. And then, yeah, here. 
And then I put down, then I put down all of the torches that I'll never, so that'll never happen again. I honestly don't know how it made its way in there. block to finish repairing that and honestly at that point I was so frustrated I just went to bed I think I re um, I think I removed that command because like that that video is so far in the past at this point. It made sense. Do 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 So yeah, I organized my ender chests. There we go, there we go. Yep, day 61, organized my ender chests. Dirties up the basement a little bit. There we go. Just not for any particular reason, just because I think that looks, looks good. And then I built a little mushroom, because I could. It goes to up here. Uh, kelp does disrupt uh, sand placement. It won't, you can't place sand and have it fall onto kelp. It will get messed up. So, yeah, you need to be very careful about that. To about there. And that works. That needs to be that. Well, honestly, I'm pretty happy with that little, little mushy. Check it out. This little mushroom by the swamp. Wait, uh, hard. I mean, sorry, my friend, probably not. Uh, do, 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 do. Alright, so, what was that? It was, I made my stone cutter for a couple, like, oop, oop, and then place it right there. Small details. It's been a while. We, we've 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 done some crazy things over the last year, almost. Yep. Yeah, Rodders, uh, Ryzak. I think you had to re, re follow at some point because of something. But yeah. Uh, it was gonna be, originally, and then so much has changed since then, more than I can put into words, like, put that in there, and then, just because I, I love this one specifically, it's such a cool little detail. Just 
Just like that little bit of water trapped inside of a stone. And then I found some more raiders. I finished building... that. Couple small details around my swamp. And I found my first wandering trader as well. Right, that. Make the PS5 tower? We might one day. Found my first wandering village. Wandering trader, and he was okay. So then I teamed them both. <laughs> They'll forgive me eventually. Alright, there we go. That's as far as we've gotten. And that's all of 116. So 117 would be what's next. And we're gonna do the raid. And then try to find a couple bits of blocks. Uh, never beaten the Ender Dragon. In your 10 years of Minecraft, oh my goodness. Uh, yeah, SMP V2. That would be your time. 117, day 62, 1.17. <clears throat> so day 65 is gonna be, yeah, probably day 65 is gonna be the last day in this world. It's gonna be exciting. Uh, no, it's the XCQ. XC, XCQ, not XQC. XCQ is a Rick Rolling. As well. So you're doing gameplay now? Um, I should probably record the voiceover too, but in all honesty, with the with the um, music and everything else, probably makes sense to just do the one hour worth of gameplay on this world, and then maybe call the stream so I can record the voiceover without any any alerts or anything else. Um, needing to come in. I didn't I didn't know that dream. Wait, didn't you come on here on a different account the other day? Uh mods do do one dot sixteen and mods one dot seventeen. Play. Yes I did. There's an imposter I have never, I've never been to Australia, unfortunately, no. I would like to, I'd like to travel. It'd be very cool. I'd be all about it. We're gonna do another Among Us night too, and we're also gonna do another Lagundo hunt again sometime soon. I think I had, <coughs> I had um, said that before, but yeah, it's gonna be fun. Actually, does it make sense to do this or does it make sense to just stick with the editing stream and I think I might just do we might just do the editing stream just to be safe. No, that's that's stream and playing Minecraft but sorry. Yeah, copy too. Okay. Oh no, hundred percent. So, yeah, let's let's do all the voiceover. Up to 117, obviously.
Do, 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 do. Okay. Uh, hello. Hey, Firestar. How you doing? Water physics before 113. They were pretty, pretty bad. Furious typing. I was sending a message. All right. Do you all want to see the recording, the audio recording process? Because it's interesting. All right. So, boop, boop. Grab all of our notes. So I did all of this. Highlight blue to the top of the dock. Okay, so then we're probably not gonna get to gameplay because probably what I'm gonna have to do is just do all of the notes and do all of the recording and then get the audio synced in with the video for everything up to 116. And then I think I then I think I'll be fine. I am half a stack of years, trader. Figure that out. <laughs> okay, so we can pause that. That was an hour, hour forty eight, of undistracted editing, with no crashes in Premiere. Suck it, horse. <laughs> uh, boats are so bad. Oh yeah. Arach wait, don't tell me you're arachnophobic. Wait, what? 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 Sorry. Nope, 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 nope. Don't need to twice the amount of time in actual find the file because you mess up. Yep. All right, so we'll see. Um, just noting, I have my music and all my audio stuff lower so that doesn't bleed into the actual recording. So hopefully, I, I apologize if I miss anything. So, yep. Yep, that's one of the Tango Tech. It's also, Impulse also used this song as well. <coughs> and now you see why my streams sound so much better. Sorry, why my videos sound so much better than my streams, because you're going to see me remove all of the messed up bits. But yeah, that's my voice right there. Um, I was gonna... I actually found a God Apple at one point in the playthrough. That's the only re reason why I didn't craft one. But that would have been good. Minecraft 117 just finally launched, and it's only half of the Caves and Cliffs update, but it already brings a bunch of new things to the Minecraft world. And it's easy to miss just how far this game has come over the last few years. I've been playing Minecraft since before the game actually launched, and I figured it was time to take a trip back through time. Revisiting Minecraft in all of its forms... No. Revisiting Minecraft at each major version through the story's history as we progress towards 117. I'm... Yeah, this is live voice recording and I'm trying to think about this. You can hear, this is different, right? This is weird. <laughs> so that's what we're gonna do in this video. This is a hundred-ish days in hardcore Minecraft with the game updating every hour. We're starting at the beginning and working our way forward. So as I loaded up the world and started in day one, I spawned in a swamp, which was a biome that I really haven't built in before, and it was something that was a lot more common back in 1.0. See, now here's where I need to go from my notes to actually like double checking what clips I had set up. I started like any Minecraft play, th oh wait, hold on, before I get into the things, I need to do all the YouTube read things. Really quickly though, before we go through all of the history of Minecraft, I have to ask you for a little favor. Uh, really quickly though, before we get it. See, this is why all my videos sound better than my streams because I do like nine takes. Yeah, no, you know, you know, you know what's coming. Really quickly though, before we get into this travel through Minecraft's history, I have to ask you for a little favor. According to YouTube analytics, only about 7% of you are actually subscribed to the channel, and if you could go ahead and subscribe, that would mean so much. Also, leave a like and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about the whole village, like maybe where the heck my horse went to, and it would help boost this video in the algorithm. 
Don't worry, that will make sense later. But now let's talk about my trip through Minecraft's history in Minecraft Hardcore. I'm recording a voiceover. It's weird, I know, it's okay. Uh, only about 7% is actually, um, is actually subscribed to the channel, like, without, without any, um, a lot of, a lot of views come from completely unsubscribed people. Uh, <laughs> so confused I have my disliking. Just double checking. So, day one, I spawned in and landed in a swamp, which in 1.0 was way more common than it actually was. There was only about half as many biomes as we enjoy in current Minecraft. I immediately started with exactly what you'd expect, punching trees to get tools and crafting those into stone tools shortly after, grabbing coal and some initial resources. Since I'm in a swamp, I figure, why don't I build with clay and bricks? It's something that I've never really worked with before, so I mined up as much of that as possible. But in day one, with building with such an expensive block, at least in early game, I had to do the whole hide in a dirt hole to make my way through the first night. So I built my mine shaft. So I built a spiral staircase down to the bedrock level and found a lava pool and then remembered I don't have a skin. So default Steve for me right now. <laughs> Everybody get in. Everybody get in. No, I'm gonna make the techno joke later. I actually have it in my notes. Bull I bullied Techno Blade for a little while. So we'll we'll get to that a little bit later. Day two, I figured, you know what? Why don't I do 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 my way right into diamonds? So I started with a strip mine on level 12. I found a little bit of lapis and dug my way into a bit of a cave system with no armor on me whatsoever. This is extremely deadly and pretty stupid. Avoiding skeletons, which are rapid fire, avoiding skeletons, which are rapid fire snipers in earlier versions of the game, I got a little bit of gold and a few additional resources heading back up to the surface in the daylight. <laughs> Um, <laughs> grabbing some, what was I saying? I headed back up to the surface in the daylight and started building the framing for my house with cobblestone in the base and oak planks for the floor. Basically all the building blocks that you actually have to work with in an older version of the game. I did make some shears though and was able to get all of the wool I needed from one sheep so they all get to live and made a bed to end the second day. Day three, I was finishing up the floor and breaking my way through all of the trees and smelting up some stone to get bricks. This is gonna be one expensive house according to Minecraft old economy standards. Placing down all the logs, I forgot horizontal logs weren't exactly a thing, so it's all vertical for me, planting a lot of cactuses and smelting up as much clay as I can into as much bricks as I can. A stack of clay is only a quarter stack of bricks, so this is gonna be really hard on resources. But sugarcane is infinitely plentiful and I'm planting as much of that as possible for early game because I'm going to want it very soon. <coughs> What's a VTuber? A uh, VTuber is somebody who uses a 3D model of themselves instead of a camera and real-time facial tracking. It's kind of cool. No, I don't say that. Like, it's, it's a really interesting culture and I think it's really cool, right? Like, they're able to be insanely popular and also remain complete anonymity right like that's i gotta say like skies doing that i think is is smart dream doing that i actually think is kind of smart as well because nobody sees what they look like irl so you can just go out and do whatever right like so i don't know i think it's kind of cool nah. all right <laughs> Day four, I did a little bit more construction on the house and then figured I'd go exploring. So I made a boat and then realized how absolutely hot garbage boats were in older version of Minecraft, breaking when contacting a leaf. Yeah, that makes sense. I ran around shearing all the sheep, forgetting that sheep in this version can't regrow their wool, so I'm gonna wait a while for that before collecting as much clay as possible from the bottom of the swamp and heading off to the top of a high mountain close to my base to try to get a general lay of the land and see what's around. No Thanos Gundo or Shrek Gundo, I appreciate that so much. Uh, yes, I'm trying to get this video done for tomorrow. 
I gotta say, with an older version of the game, none of my Optifine or anything else, seeing that fog in the distance feels kind of claustrophobic. I'm used to my 32 chunks in every direction, and having less than 10 makes the world feel very small. But as the but as the hour rolled over, it's time for our first upgrade. Version 1.1 of Minecraft bought beaches and hills, and you could finally enchant your bow, which was pretty cool. Golden app Golden apples changed their recipes, and this is back when you could craft a god apple. So if I can get enough gold, I'm definitely going to be getting some of this. It's also when music discs were added to the game, and sheep can now eat grass to regrow their wool. So turns out I didn't have to wait too long. Out loud without pronouncing the numbers. How would I even do that? How would I even do that? Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. So I clock. How do you. Yeah, that's so hard. Sorry, y'all messing with me, and maybe I shouldn't do this. Maybe I should just end the stream. <laughs> oh no. Okay. So I climbed down the hill with the version updated and went to the beach, crafting a boat since there's no lily pads in sight and it might just survive the trip. I found my way into a glass. I found my way over a chunk border into some plains with some spruce trees off in the distance. And I thought, you know what? Spruce wood looks really good. So I tried to harvest as much of that as I could before it got late enough that I needed to go back and hide in the hole in the floor, smelting up a lot of stone into stone bricks so I could decorate the walls. Day five, as I, oh god, day five, as I crested my way back up, I turned all of the, oh, day five, as I escaped from my hole in the ground, I turned all of the logs into planks, and they all turned into oak, because spruce wood wasn't added in version 1.1, just the trees were. So I made a lot of them into chests, and then supports, and then finally crafted my first piece of armor, which was a pair of pants. I grabbed a little bit of sand and started smelting that into glass for windows into day six when a skeleton tried to snipe me from the lake and like I said, skeletons are super deadly in earlier versions of Minecraft. But trees are so much better with one piece of bone meal guaranteeing the tree growing. So it's a lot cheaper in this old one. They also catch fire a lot easier. So I accidentally had a little bit of a forest fire but I was able to get it. Eh. They also catch fire a lot easier, so they kept bursting into flames around my little lava pool, which was super unfortunate. <clears throat> but as I continued to harvest sugarcane and organize my resources, this hour went by pretty fast. And now it's on to version 1.2. This was the first world... And now it's on to version 1.2. This was the first major world generation change and where you're gonna see those much more harsher chunk borders. It also added jungle biomes, redstone lamps, and iron golems, so villages could finally defend themselves. Do, do, do. I'm gonna turn your camo on. It also apparently breaks doors as I walked out of my house and found them completely messed up. I finished up the floor and sheared a bunch of sheep and then end the night was attacked by a ton of mobs, creepers and everything trying to get through the door. In the morning I survived but some of the mobs were still hanging around and a creeper for the first time actually blew up part of my house. Don't worry, this won't be the last time and that's really bad. I jumped in the boat however and started sailing past I jumped in a boat, eh, yeah, god, this is so hard and it's harder with 40 people watching me. <laughs> I'm so self-conscious right now, because when I'm talking to you all, that's easy, I'm just responding. But I know I'm watching ev every single one of you is just eyes locked on me and I'm trying to do something else and it's messing with me. Alright, so boats, coal, another first village, pumpkins. I don't know how that means. I'm so confused. Um, after quickly repairing the grounds, I jumped into another boat, and thankfully it didn't die on a lily pad this time, and I was able to make my way to the first chunk border. Af yeah, no, it's fine. After repair- <laughs> Stop counting, I appreciate it, Camo, but stop counting. Uh, 
After repairing the ground, I jumped in another boat, grabbed a little bit of coal from the bottom of the swamp, and then found my way to a few cows for some leather, traveling over a chunk border, suddenly ending up in a desert village, which had just suddenly appeared. Right next to it was a swamp with some pumpkins, so you can tell the terrain's all sorts of messed up. And looking at these old villages, I remember there's no beds in them, so I made my own and slept inside. Yeah, old wheat textures, right? On day eight, I raided all of the books that I po- eh. On day eight, I raided all of the books that I possibly could so that I could speed run my way towards an enchanting table and did a little bit more mining for coal and iron. I still don't have a full set of armor. I kept running through the desert and then back through the swamp, harvesting my sugarcane and then sleeping as quickly as possible to get through these early days to the versions of Minecraft that are a little more forgiving. Yeah. Old wheat textures, yep, no, 100%, 100%. Some of this made me feel really old because I remember it happening the first time around, right? On day nine, I was mainly smelting up the clay balls to get more bricks so that I can continue building my house, converted the converted the sugarcane into paper, and then started crafting books. But that's not the recipe. That actually changed a little bit later. So all you really need to do is convert the paper and stack it vertically, which is so much cheaper. So I made all of the bookcases that I possibly could. <coughs> I also smelted up all the iron and finally made my full set of iron armor. So it was that much less likely that I'm gonna die using bricks to complete the house and work my way up. Since the start, but not in Java. Yep. wait, go to bed, go to bed, go to bed, dream using bricks to continue building the house, but like I said, this is gonna take a lot in early Minecraft. This is super expensive. Minecraft 1.3 was the first time villagers actually did anything. It introduced emeralds and ender chests, and it introduced all the different woods, which is technically a 1.2.4, but this is the first time I'm gonna get it. Wooden slabs were also finally really Wooden slabs also finally existed, the gravel texture changed, and logs can finally be placed sideways, but it's not exactly that easy. So, this day was outside, buckets, running around, grabbing some more spruce, some iron, and then back, basically. On day 10, it was basically the quest for spruce wood, since I had unfortunately converted all of it into oak planks somehow in a previous version. I made a couple buckets and then sailed. I made a couple buckets and then ran my way over the desert, sailed my way over the ocean to the spruce forest, grabbed as many logs and some iron as I could, and worked my way back, grabbing an ender pearl on the way, my first in this world. Uh, yes, wheel is available this stream. On the way back though, I found a jungle biome, which just came into existence one version before. So it was cool to grab some of this wood since now it actually meant something. As it rolled over to day 11, I was still harvesting the second half of the jungle tree without efficiency on my tools. That takes so much time. Before running through the forest, trying to find some cocoa beans. To be fair though, I don't think I actually ever planted them. They just kind of sat in a chest. I grabbed a little bit more leather and then ran through the spruce forest for sale. Eh. I grabbed a little bit more leather, ran through the spruce forest, sailed back over the chunk border ocean, and landed back in my house right at the end of day 11. Day 12, since the floor can now be slabs and the top of them, and day 12, since this floor can now be made half a block thinner, and I'll have a little bit more headspace down at the bottom here, I started ripping out all of the floor and converting it to spruce top slabs. I also tried to change all of the logs to be horizontal, but the mechanics on this were a lot different. It was based off of your orientation to the block, not what face you're replacing it against, so it's all sorts of weird. I made a bunch of chests though, and started working on a dock outside, adding some windows to the front of the house, and really just starting to decorate. Working my way through it. Day 13, I continue working on that dock, setting it out over the water, and just having a place to go fishing from, even though I wouldn't go fishing for a little while. Started working on a spiral staircase from the bottom all the way up to the top, and experienced my first absolutely cursed block that I couldn't pick up and was just sitting there taunting me. Oh, your brain can't process this. It's it, This is different. This is different. Uh, even though, it, yeah, right? Like, I'm not talking to you, I'm talking to something else, and you're gonna see it in the video. Um, 
But really it's time to start harvesting things up and securing my overall area. I made some area to plant the pumpkins and plant torches all around my base, making a little bit of a rudimentary farm to the side of my base to grow some wheat. I also started doing the speedrunner style nether portal and it went horribly wrong. But thankfully I didn't turn all of it into obsidian and was able to get a portal ready, but I was out of time on this version of Minecraft. But thankfully I didn't turn all of it into obsidian, but unfortunately I was out of time and it was time to upgrade again. <coughs> version 1.4 version 1.4 was the first named update of Minecraft and it was the pretty scary update. It added it added wither skeletons to the nether and walls and anvils to the overworld, including flower pots, which is something that you would think had been there from the beginning. Item frames were also added, so it's finally a lot easier to label your chests. If it does feel like I'm, it, it's, it's, it's weird. This is weird. Uh, yeah, no, hold on, hold up for that. All right, I don't have the best of luck with the nether, so before I went, I made a little flower pot and just planted an oak sapling there. It's basically all that can go in these right now, and the house looks nicer for it. But I left the portal and went through, held my breath, and spawned inside a nether fortress. Gundo, luck is king! <laughs> Tweaking the brightness since it resets on each one of these upgrades, the settings were a nightmare to deal with. I found my way to the I found my way to the first garden area getting all of the nether wart and soul soil from here. Then there was a second, which was nice. I had a lot more. Eventually hitting the exterior transition and finding my way towards the blaze spawner. Now, this is a lot harder cuz you don't have a shield to block the fire bolts and easier at the same time cuz you can just swing your sword like an absolute madman. Except when it breaks, and this is back in old Minecraft when an axe was really just a tool, so I was pretty much done heading back to the portal. The logs were now a lot easier to turn horizontal, so I don't think we mentioned Gundo Luck on a stream, or on a video I mean. The logs were a lot easier to turn horizontal now, so I switched all of those over and then went, and then found my first slime bouncing underneath my staircase and grabbed my first couple slime balls. <coughs> Day 15, I woke up and needed to organize all of my chests so I had control of everything. But then it was time for another expedition, bouncing around on another boat and the dramatic pause seeing if it would break when hitting a lily pad. Thankfully, no, it actually survives. Grabbing a lot more spruce and... I grabbed a lot more spruce and then took some bones around and tamed all of the wolves that I possibly could. I wanted an army in this world. All it takes is me bopping something once, and they pretty much finish it off. It's awesome. Viva la hole. Doggy friends. Yeah, doggy friends in this world. I think I topped out at seven tamed wolves at this point, and that was the best it would ever get. Don't worry. I think I topped out at seven tamed wolves over here on this continent, which was pretty great. Day 16, the cursed chunk borders continue. And I lost my first wolf. <laughs> Day 16, the cursed chunk borders continue and I lost my first wolf to that fall. No, 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 none of that. But thankfully I made a new one. Uh, so the head looks so derpy compared to the body. I sailed from landmass to landmass so they would teleport towards me, but eventually took a journey just a little too far and lost them on the edge of the jungle. I'll have to return later for them when I can travel a little bit better, maybe with boats or leads. On the way back, I found and killed another enderman, which I'm just glad pearls are dropping at the higher rates. That's absolutely fantastic. Before, before making it into my house and getting to bed. Day 17, it's time to go back to the mines. I need more resources. Hive mind, hive mind, yep, no, absolutely. Uh, I'm using uh, Adobe Premiere Pro. Uh, who knows if Lugino is actually live? Maybe this whole thing is recorded. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Day 17, it's time to go back to the mines to grab a lot more resources. Like I said, golden apples are craftable in these older versions of the game, so I wanna get as much gold as I possibly can.
Where, where do we get? I found my way into a really dope cave system, which is the older generation just, it hit a little bit different. <clears throat> before making my way, before making my way into a ravine and you guessed it, an abandoned mine shaft. Some things are just always consistent for me. Crafted up torches and repaired my pickaxe, which had broke during all of this, grabbing all of the coal before the hour dinged. I crafted up a bunch of torches and made a new pickaxe after mine broke before the hour alarm was up. <coughs> Version 1.5 was a little bit of a quieter one, really only launching Minecraft Realms and allowing you to enchant books. There was a lot of bug fixes in this one though, so not a lot of new blocks to interact with, but really just a good version to lay over and go through the caves. We have a wheel? Wait, do we have a wheel? I'll pause the audio. Do we have a wheel? Did I miss a wheel? Uh, yes, it is because I'm updating the world between versions of Minecraft. TNT, do wheel. Do it. I'm just waiting. Oh, okay. Oh, well, fine. Back to work. Never mind. There's a wheel. And there's two wheels. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Two wheels, three wheels. Okay. All right, we're gonna do three wheels, four wheels, four wheels. Wait. Okay, no, it was carping camo. How many wheels are we gonna do? Derpy being the third wheel. Ha ha ha. All right, four wheels. TNT, you are first. If this is four timeouts, I'm gonna laugh so hard. All right, TNT, you're first. May you be judged harshly. Totally random. Word ban, oh no. I have to record voiceover. No, 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 no. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. I'm not recording voiceover. Oh shit. <laughs> Okay. Alright, next is... Who's next? Carp's next. Carp, sorry, see you in, see you in 10 minutes. <laughs> Alright, Derpy. I need to stand up. Oh god. I need to stand up. I don't want to stand up to record. Uh camera. My audio will sound different because I did that. Oh no! <laughs> A second word has been banned. I'm just I'm just gonna I'm just gonna load it up. I can't do this. I can't do this. I can't not, I can't record my voiceover badly because of a wheel spin. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna wait for you to say it. I'm gonna wait for you to say it. All right. Okay. All right, here we go. 10 minute timer. Wait for it. And it's five gifted subs per one that I fail, right? Basically, it's five gifted subs for per one that I fail, right? One second, one second, one second. Just give me a second. Basically, right? Okay, ready? Ready? Damn, what a day for you all to tell me that I couldn't say the word version. <laughs> I can't.
can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. Subs to the community. So, ten to all of you. <laughs> World record. I gave up. So, uh, Mankey, Ghost of Seth, Gensugar, Blue, t Blue, uh, Blue Turquoise, B, <laughs> B Person, Hot Dog, uh, Dean. And Mum of Chibis, congratulations, all of you being yeeted into subscribership by two very toxic people with the wheel. Okay. Any percent failure world record? Yep, nope, 100%. All right. This is the worst possible thing that we could do. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just laughing. I think it's, I think it's funny. Toxic was the word to come to mind. Toxic is not the appropriate word. You are correct. It would be mean. Mean would be the word that I would use for all of you. <laughs> I am standing. There you go. We we stand. You bully me. Chat bullies me. Crafty works too. Crafty totally works too. Do, 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 do. Stan Gundo, I am standing now. Plug Twitch. I I will at the end. <laughs> I will at the end. I, I want to get. I, I want to do this a bit. Don't complain. Yeah, Hive Mize bully. No, 100 percent, 100 percent. Hey ASM, how you doing? Okay, where were we? Where we were? Where were we? Version to lay over and go through the caves. We have a wheel. Wait. Do oh, okay. So that was um. That was basically this. Uh, that was basically this. So to here. Da -da -da -da. Okay, so uh, day 18. I saw a bit of mossy cobblestone leading into a skeleton spawner, which didn't really have any passable loot. A 5k wheel spins. Yep. Uh, yep. <laughs> and they were very difficult, and we did it. Yep, no, 100%. Yep, seen. Yep, no, see, professional. Professional here, everybody. Professional. Pro streamer. Pro streamer. The most, the most, uh, the most pro of streamers. <laughs> yep, no, 100%. 100% pro streamer. Okay. Day 18. Uh, and voice crack. Goodness. Day 18, in looking through the ravine, I saw a little bit of mossy cobblestone, which meant a skeleton spawner was embedded into the wall. The loot inside was pretty much nothing, and a little bit of gold and other resources through the ravine was pretty valuable until I found my first diamond. Singular. Oh, actually, there was two. But that was enough to get me into a diamond pickaxe, which really opens up my possibilities. Yeah, whoa, he said it. Nope, no, 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 it's just once. It's just once. Once I fail, it's over. Mining obsidian without any enchantments is the slowest thing ever in all of Minecraft and it absolutely hurts my soul. With that on board though, I kept... <coughs> With that on board though, I kept working my way through all... <laughs> With that on board though, I worked my way through all of the ravine and eventually tried swimming up a chain of water, which is now the second most hard thing to do in all of Minecraft. So I went back down to the surface level. So I went back down to the bottom of the mines and just strip mined my way around, finding more diamonds before digging straight up and before digging straight up and breaching the surface on day 19 over in the middle of the desert. After a short run, I found my way home with a void chunk underneath my fence, but thankfully everything was still working. Smelted up all of the iron and crafted my enchanting table, finally popping it into place and remembering that enchanting is going to be super expensive in this version. I continued the staircase from the lower level to the top. <laughs> I continued the staircase from the lower level to the upper level, so all of my house actually connected to all of the rest of my house. Converting all of the walls to stone brick. I wanted to place upside down stairs at the tops of these little alcoves. Turns out you can't yet. It's just not possible. Do you like 40 push-ups? I like the gifted subs though. I think it's funner. Uh, not yet. But it was once again time to harvest all of the sugarcane. 
so that I would have all of the paper. You know I'm prepping for an elytra, you know, 40 days from now. But the main thing I need right now is clay. So after crafting a diamond sword, I went out and dug as much of that as, wait, is that night? No. I went out and dug as much of that as possible and put a little bit of netherrack in place to fix the funky lava that I had messed up. Day 21, the little two blocks of dirt in front of my house just really isn't cutting it. Day 21, the two blocks of dirt in front of my house just really isn't cutting it, so I spent a little bit of time terraforming the land and making the entrance to the house a little bit bigger. Planting more bricks around the entire structure, I think I've hit the top of where I wanna go, so it's time to start working on the roof. One last thing I wanted to add to the house though, with all of this extra height, is a bit of a loft that I'm gonna put my bed on, so it's technically gonna be like two and a half floors tall. I harvested all of the wheat from the little farm and then decided to move the farm somewhere else. So I jumped around, planted a little bit different and moved all of the farming to the opposite side of the house. So I'd have a space for wolves. So I'd have a space for my wolves. So I was finally able to get them back home. Old boats are the worst. <laughs> or, you know, I could get a horse like a cut. Or, you know, I could get a horse because version 1.6 is the horse update. It added horses, hay bales, terracotta, which was still called hardened clay back then. And cl Why did coal? What? Coal's not a... Why did I say coal? Coal's been a thing since, like, forever. Um, or maybe it's charcoal. I forgot. Oh, redoing a lot of the furnished stuff. Or maybe I could get a horse. Yeah, it was, it was, remember, yeah. Uh, yeah, obviously. Or maybe I could get a horse because version 1.6 was the horse update. It added horses, hay bales, terracotta, which was still called hardened clay back then, and as well as leads. So you could finally lead mobs around instead of just holding up some food and hoping for the best. With leads being a thing and slime being in oh, my welcome. inventory, uh, hey, hey, Nat, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Some people call it the, the taco update. Yep. Thankfully, a premature lead in slime form started bouncing its way over all of my crops, and I was able to get just enough slime balls to make a couple leads. Maybe I should go rescue the dogs. My boat once again shattered into a million pieces as soon as it touched a leaf, so that totally makes sense. And I ran across the desert over to the other ocean and went to where I thought the wolves were, but I made a bit of a wrong turn, finding my way into a village with a bunch of horses around it. I didn't have anywhere to sleep though, and I didn't bring any wool, so sorry sheep, you helped me finish day 22. Mission Barkable, I love it. Uh, what in the Gundo Luck? Oh, this whole video is Gundo Luck, don't worry. Oh, be back, welcome back, Carp. On day 23, I started looking around through all of the villagers, seeing if... All right, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're, we're just done. We're done. I, 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 I can't. I can't. I can't do it. I can't. <laughs> Control Shift T. Why are you gonna block me on that, ECR? Why are you gonna do that to me? Why are you gonna do that to me? You, 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 you absolute madman. You absolute madman. <laughs> All right, before I'm bankrupt, <laughs> I think we need to end the stream and I need to focus. <laughs> we need to, I, I need to focus. It was, it was absolutely worth the 10K cookies. So Kings, Blue, <laughs> Dick Book, Hazel and Roy, congratulations on being yeeted into the subscribership by the wheel. No, I think, in, in all honesty though, this is, it's messing with me. And I think if I wanna get this video done, the editing, the editing we were able to do, but I think if we wanna get the video done, I need to like, I need to dig in and focus. I really apologize everybody. I really need, wow, the first timer for the first word band just happened. So, 
No, I think I need to dig in and focus. There's gonna be a bunch of little fiddly bits that I need to do. I need to, I need to power through and try to get it. I'm gonna try to get this video out this weekend, either Saturday or Sunday, one of the two, but it's gonna be out. But no, I appreciate you all coming in and, and bullying me. Uh, <laughs> ECR got it for 67% off and early. Have to turn tail. Yep, no. <laughs> I have to. I have to. I'm sorry, Gold. I apologize, but we do need to. I do need to end it. <laughs> oh yeah. We do it because we love you. I love you all too, and I appreciate you all so much. Thank you, uh, mods. If you could do me a favor and do a quick look to see if we can find anybody really quickly, uh, just so we can get it. Uh, just so we can get uh, a raid going on and spread some of the love and or the chaos. To somebody else. <laughs> I'm sorry, Gold, but there's gonna be a new video on the channel probably tomorrow, if not on Sunday, and that'll be fun. So that'll be good. I'm gonna try to see if we can get it premiered. Um, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It just it's uh, nah. Uh, I, I I'm just fine. I appreciate it though. Uh, I'm hoping I'm hoping it'll be good, but I need to like dig in, nail this down, have it land really well. Probably redo some of the voiceover because I was too busy laughing. <laughs> I have one hour worth of footage and then all the like intro, outro, fiddly bits. If I can power through it, it might be done by like 2 a.m. And if so, it'll go live tomorrow. And if not, it'll go live on Sunday. Because I gotta, I gotta get this video out. It's been too long, I gotta get some things. We crushed the stream sub goal, absolutely. Because I gifted like 15 subs. <laughs> <laughs> So, thanks, Tom. I appreciate it. You found a person? Okay, are you sending it to me on Discord? Do, 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 do. Uh. Do, 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 do. Alright, we got somebody. Good luck with anything. Thanks, Carp. Monday, you hope you got wheel. Good luck. Yeah, gee, I wonder how. Nah, it's fine. Nah, if anything, I think it's hilarious. I really do. But it's probably just a good idea to to try to dig in and focus and and do that. No, nah, it's all good. It's all good. I love it. I anything to anything to thank you all for all of the support. I really appreciate it. Here's hoping the new video brings a bunch more cool people to the stream. That'd be good. Thank you, Gold. I really appreciate it. Thank you, everybody, for joining in on the chaos and hanging out with what was kind of an unorthodox stream. I know not playing and instead doing the video editing, it was weird. Um, Snazzy, you have no idea how badly I want to sit down right now. You're not wrong. Uh, <laughs> it was weird. It was different. Um, my, my legs are in fact undone and wish to be tired and sitting. <laughs> all right that's it for me thank you all so much remember for the raid we're going to spread some positivity and get some other people hyped up help raise up others so try to be good uh yeah i'm gonna hopefully see you for the video i might or might not stream immediately after it we'll see but that's it for me for today thank you all for tuning in until next time take care of yourselves be good to each other I will see you all around the internet, Twitter, YouTube, follow all the places. Bye-bye, everybody. Let's go raid, and I'll see you next time.